For nearly two months, the Carl Perkins Civic Center has been a temporary warming shelter for homeless men in Jackson. Within the next couple of days, temperatures will drop significantly, and the nonprofits who oversee this shelter are preparing for an uptick in patrons. For the rest of the week, going into the weekend, temperatures will drop into the 30s and 20s. We're, we're hoping that more people that are experiencing homelessness will take advantage of the warming center. While Tennessee Homeless Solutions works on a permanent mail shelter, the Civic Center has been available for people at night, but more provisions are being made. And so there are provisions that are being made so that if um, temperatures are below freezing during the day, uh, those guys have a place to go that's safe, warm, and they're provided with a meal. Other than Tennessee Homeless Solutions, the other nonprofits that work with the shelter are the Salvation Army, RIFA, and United Way. Late last year, a homeless man froze to death, which sped up the process to organize a temporary shelter. Kansia says having the Civic Center right now increases the chance of saving lives. So this warming shelter is uh, extremely helpful for the community. And so to have this temporary warming shelter will help save lives and help the quality of lives for those that are currently living in homelessness. Jacinta Render, 39 News, Jackson.